Hello, everyone. Actually, not everyone. Hello, you. Yes, you watching me now. Uh, this is 2022, and uh, I thought about making this video to talk to you. I want to talk to you because this is still January. I'm not sure what your New Year resolution is, but I want to suggest one. My name is Pascal Zifo, and um, I don't know when. I don't know when you started with um, cryptocurrencies, blockchain, online businesses, or multi-level marketing. Whatever you started back in the days, or a year ago, or six months ago. What I want to tell you is that we have something in common. And what we have in common is the fact that when I started these things, it wasn't fun. I lost and lost, just like you. So my question to you today is, are you still on the sideline in 2022 because of the loss you suffered in the past? I'm not sure, and I cannot even guess how painful it's been for you and probably for your family too, um, to invest into something that didn't work out. Was it a scam? Was it an actual business that just didn't work out? What was it? Is that the reason why you're still on the sideline? There's this new thing out there called blockchain or cryptocurrencies or DeFi or whatever you name it, NFTs, metaverse. This is a new thing that you better get involved with because if you don't, you will actually be left on the sideline. It is here to stay. Do not, do not use the fact that you've been scammed or you've lost money online or whatever, it, you know, not to educate yourself. Don't see it as investing. Do not invest if you don't want to invest, but educate yourself. If you haven't picked a new year resolution, I suggest this one to you. Educate yourself when it comes to cryptocurrencies, blockchain, and uh, you know anything that revolves around that tema. Because that is a future that is here today. It is not going anywhere. There is a lot of scams out there using cryptocurrencies, blockchain, and all kinds of projects revolving around that word or those words. However, educating yourself, doing some research, doing some readings has never put anybody in a bad situation. It doesn't matter what you lose in the process, but one thing you gain in that nobody will ever take away from you is the knowledge, is information, and information is power. So I wanted to share this with you and tell you that be very careful on in the process in your, you know, in the process, you'll, you'll meet a lot of people, you'll meet a lot of uh, projects and business opportunities. And, you know, some of them will promise the world to you. Just be aware that 98% of them are potentially scams. And they're just as good as the paper that they have their PowerPoint on. So always do your own due diligence before you decide to join anything. Always, always do your due diligence. Do some research. If you don't know how to research a project, I don't even want to share something to you, uh, with you. Go online and, and, uh, and do some research. How do I evaluate? How do I assess a project? but do something. So 
a lot of those things are scams. Don't get scammed. Do what it takes not to get scammed. A quick hint, avoid anything that promised you anything that sounds unrealistic. Somebody start telling you that you'll be making, I don't know, you'll be making or doubling your money within a week or a month. Don't believe it. It's a scam. You might get some money at the beginning, but then it will not last. So take your time, read the projects, ask for white paper. Maybe it's a new word for you, but um, most projects, if not all, have what we call a white paper that basically describes what they're planning on doing, what's the projects behind you know, the opportunity that is being presented to you. Do your research and try not to go on just one project. Try to diversify. Give yourself a chance to have a leg to lean on if the other projects that you join is not picking up yet. Diversify in terms of project. Diversify also in terms of the um, industry where you, you're investing. It is very important. When looking for projects, look for projects that actually solve a problem, a real problem. Look for projects that bring a solution to an actual need. If you can identify those, then you're on a good start. But just don't do nothing because you, you say you got scammed in the past, you, you, know, you lost money here or there, because you will always lose money. And you don't lose money because somebody's scamming you. You're losing money sometimes because the business just didn't work out. Not every single business that starts uh, makes it to, you know, after a year or two. Whatever you do, do something. Educate yourself on the blockchain because I strongly believe that most people will be losing money. Right now, this, it is like less than 3% of the people in the world, the world population, less than 3% is aware of the blockchain and cryptocurrencies. So majority of the people will lose money, not because they got scammed, but because they didn't have the right information, because they didn't get educated properly when it comes to the blockchain and cryptocurrencies and the basic knowledge that everyone involved in this industry is supposed to know. You don't want to be one of those. So educate yourself, learn about the blockchain, learn about cryptocurrencies, learn about the DeFi and so on, because they're here to stay. So stop staying on the sideline saying, you know, using excuses. You cannot make excuses and money at the same time. You've got to pick one. And don't expect, don't expect that your life will change from now to tomorrow. No, it doesn't work that way. It doesn't matter what business you join, whether online or anywhere else, it takes time. You gotta plan mid to long-term. It takes time. If in the process you get some short-term gain, that's great. But be aware that it takes time and um, choose your projects wisely and you will give yourself a good chance of success. So I hope this video finds you in good health. And I wish you to find the right projects for you and your family that will help you achieve your financial freedom if that's what you're looking for. All right. Thank you and uh, Happy New Year 2022. And I wish you a lot of success and a very strong health. Bye-bye.